Greetings, Cancer. Welcome to your reading for the time period of August 6th to the 18th. I'm using Legacy Tarot. That's what it looks like there. If you are new to my channel and you have never seen me use these for general readings, these are Legacy Tarot. These I also think are European based. I also think they're European based as well. I think I say European based. Yes. Okay. Let's see what energies come through for you, Cancer. Cancer. Someone rising. Cancer, my loves. Ace of Cups. There is a new relationship that you have. It could be with a Piscean energy, a Pisces female. This energy, they're becoming really close to you if it's a family member or a friend or coworker. Um, this energy is becoming really close to you if it's a bisexual thing. Maybe you like this energy or, this, or you're finding out that this energy likes you. It's a Pisces female. Uh, you could be dealing with Piscean male energies. If you're dealing with a Pisces man, they're revealing things. If you're dealing with a Pisces woman, they're revealing things. So you feel you're pretty much in between two Pisces, Piscean energies. If you look at the triangle right here in the middle, that could be you <laughs> right there. If you look at it really closely, that could be you. And that could be the two Pisces energies there. Um, you need their help because they saw something. So they could have seen your partner cheating. They could have seen an injustice go down in the workplace. They could have seen something being stolen from you, whatever situation is it, or, or it's external, and you're in a relationship with somebody new and they're helping you, period. They're helping you figure out, um, they're also trying to, there's also something going on here with a murder case or a murder scene. Um, if it's a Pisces, that energy is also trying to help you with that. They have answers into how somebody passed or how someone died or how they were killed with this Ace of Cups energy being here. So if you're dealing with news, anything pertaining to news, family secrets, like there's, and these energies could be family members that you are, you're tag teaming with to help you figure out the truth about a murder or a, uh, um, I, I, I guess it's about like a chasing or a cheating. So either, either somebody was cheating and you're chasing them, vice versa. You could be the one that's being chased or you're chasing someone in the sense, this could be chase, like chase bank. You know, but something's going on with breaking in. So maybe you feel like some, it could be a Piscean energy or maybe you're using a Pisces to help you get into like a, a frozen account or our savings account with this Ace of Cups energy. Um, you didn't know that someone knew how to do those things. So it could be like a really, like this could be like a frozen account that somebody is trying to help you get into. And maybe they have like passwords and um, they can have passwords and like secret combinations to get into um, some type of account. This could be your husband's account. You know, maybe you feel your husband or your boyfriend, your girlfriend, whoever, your partner's account, that they, they keep it really locked. But I guess I'm about a Sag. This, you're tag teaming with a Piscean female, male, whatever. You're tag, tag teaming with them to figure out what a Sag has locked. So it could be like a cabinet. It, this could be like a uh, um, a case, like a, a a case that has like a combination on it. This could be a door that has a lock. This could be a damn door that has a combination that you need to get into. Whatever it is here, and um, um, you're not gonna like what you. You're either gonna like what you see inside, or you're not gonna like what you see inside. So either you're trying to get into somebody's account, like a bank account, and you need the passwords for that, and maybe this either there's a large amount of money in there. You're trying to okay, and now I see somebody if you are married like your partner if it's a sag whatever or a water sign your partner they have been um it doesn't have to be a sag could also be aries those two are men to be specific they could also be female if you're dealing with a female aries they're helping you but you don't want their help because you feel like maybe somebody's gonna steal more than they have been somebody's gonna try to take more than they've been than they've than they've been actually 
um, acts to take with this energy. So you got a greedy Aries female. If you're dealing with Aries men and you're dealing with a, uh, uh, a Sag man, these energies are the ones that have something locked away in a case or in, a, in an account, in a chase account to be specific. They have the past words, but you're using a Piscean energy to help you get into these combinations, get into these doors, these locked doors. Um, there's a chamber, these locked chambers or wherever it is, could be a damn basement with a damn lock. So you either you're going to like, you're going to see inside or you're not going to like what you're going to see inside. So either it's some type of amount of money or it's things, it's prizes, it's gifts, it's this, that, and the third. And you're trying to figure out who those things are for. So this could be people that you do business with. You know, maybe you feel like someone in the business, in your business being shady and they're hiding funds from you. This could be like a, um, this could be like a business partner that you work with that you are very close to and they have things kept away very, very tight. So either you, you could be doing business with your partner, like your husband, your wife, you could be doing business with them and, but they keep you, you, you're finding out that they keep, they, they have like a separate stash of money that you cannot ask you cannot access so there's a need to access that so either you're gonna like what you see you're not gonna you're not gonna like what you see so these are either people that you work with they're being secretive with you and they got secret doors and closets that you're trying to get into you're like what the hell is in here or it's your partner or it's your husband that's doing this your Sagittarius husband your Aries man they've got like pamp I guess what pampers they got pampers hidden somewhere. It could be for like another kid. It kind of reminds me of the most recent reading that I did for you. Somebody has kids that they they have not told you that they have. So either it's external and it's, I get a Capricorn, it's external and it's happening to a Capricorn energy. Um, I get the Capricorn is married to a Sag. You know that. That's it. That energy is like your sister-in-law or they're like they're connected to your family. Somehow the Capricorn energies could be happening to a Capricorn. Maybe somebody is being somebody's partner is keeping a secret child from there. And it's a Sagittarius energy. So either it's your Sag or it's a Capricorn energy Sag. OK, it's a Sagittarius man. That's really shady. And I don't really feel too heavy that you're dealing with a Sagittarius woman too much. If you are, they're a distant friend. They also are a rape victim for some reason. Like a sad woman is a rape victim. You could be finding that out on the news. Pisces is enlightening you on that. You know, somebody's a rape victim. A Capricorn or a, Pi or, or, or a Sagittarius woman is a rape victim. But when I said that, it's because of an Aries. It's because of an Aries. So it's either as an Aries man. Okay, now I see what's going on here. If you are a, a Cancerian woman, there's an Aries man that slept with a Capricorn or does Aries man that slept with a Sagittarius woman and that energy is crying rape and you're in the middle of that somehow. And you're, and that's, this is my husband is being charged with these things. My boyfriend is being charged with these things. Like how did this happen? Or you're dealing with secretive shit in a job or in a family or in a marriage, whoever you're dating, whoever you're talking to. And a Pisces has a Pisces somehow like a Pisces. They they're like cats. They have eyes on, on, in the back of their damn head. They've got eyes in their head. So either they're very intuitive. They, I get they know what they know what your partner has been doing. So either it's a business partner, maybe your business partner has been hiding secretive children and secretive stashed away accounts and money, whatever, or it's our um they somehow they know that. So either they're they somebody has like a like a, a knack for um what do you call somebody has a really good tongue, like they have a knack to get somebody to reveal things to them somehow. So either it's a Piscean energy, like that. that's just the energy of Pisces. Somehow they're able to break down people to reveal things to them somehow. That's just the way they are. And that's why you're tag teaming with a Pisces to figure out what your partner has been doing, what your partner has been lying about, cheating, cheating accounts, secret of accounts, secret of women, secret of children, men, women, whatever. You're trying to find out these things. It's really shady. It's really shady, but a Pisces energy is enlightening you on this could be, like I said, it could be external and it's happening to a Capricorn. You think that a Capricorn female doesn't know that a Sagittarius and an Aries energy have a child together. Like you think that with that energy. Okay. Three of cups for what you're, what you're trying to ask about. If this is a party, there ain't no damn time to be partying. <laughs> There's too much secrecy. This, the three of cups is all about gossip as well, but you, you really don't have time to party. If you need like one or two glasses of wine or a shot, go ahead and do it because a lot of shit is coming out. That's going to make you want to drink <laughs> this half of August. It's, there's a lot of stuff that's coming out. That's going to make you want to drink. You're going to lose your damn mind. You're going to lose your mind in a good way or a bad way, whatever it is. That energy could just be a new relationship. 
chill, chill, chill. It's not all crazy stuff that's being revealed. This could just be a new relationship where somebody's trying to be really sexually involved with you and you're like, you know, you, there's something going to have a loosening up. So if you're in a new partnership with someone, somebody's trying to loosen you up with drinks, point blank. They're trying to loosen you up with drinks, but you don't understand why you keep going in and out of these situations with guys. Like if you're a female, you're like, why do these guys want to drug me? I didn't even mean to say that. I meant to say drink or get me. Why Why do they want to get me drunk? Why are they pulling at my panties? Why are they doing these kind of, someone's going to have with easiness. So be careful being easy with men. There's a Pisces energy. Again, be careful being easy with a Pisces. You know, they could be a man or woman, but they could also be someone that's trying to protect your sexual, your sexual self, your aura, your space, that the energy is trying to tell you, don't just open your legs for anybody. Like it could be a family member or an aunt or a cousin or a friend. You know, gossip energy. They're just trying to tell you that, that you're trying to understand why guys, why you're meeting the same kind of dudes. If you're a female, you have a Piscean friend that there are whoever water sign friend that's trying to enlighten you on what you're doing or what guys see about you. Period. So if you're a dude, you could be partying a lot. You could be partying a lot. You could be drinking a lot. You could be gossiping as well. Guys gossip. That's pretty much. But you're if you're a dude, you're gossip. You're gossiping about what your brother is doing to his wife. If you're a guy, you're gossiping about these things. Whatever it is is not cool. <laughs> you know, if you're a female, you could be gossiping about what your brother is what your brother is doing to his wife. That's why I said external Capricorn energy. Well, your brother could be a Sag. Your ordinaries, whatever your brother could be, one of those fire signs, and there's also this like you you're starting to figure out ways to how to help someone. So if you feel like your your in law is being done is being done dirty, you want to jump in and help your in law. But maybe you, that's why I also get this element where that's why you have been inviting an in law out. But I also get a sister. That's why you're inviting your sister out. Your sister's husband or boyfriend could be doing her wrong. You know, you don't understand why your sister is still with somebody. So you're you're talking to your sister like, why are you still with him? You're talking to your brother, you're, or you're you're cheating. Your your brother is cheating on his wife. Your brother is cheating, or your brother has a child with somebody. Wow, that's crazy. Whatever it is, or it's your husband. But these, whatever I just named, these things are also happening to you. So if you're finding out, if you're trying to gossip about cheating that's happening external from your partnership, it's also happening to you in business and love. It's also happening to you. But like I said, it's a Pisces going to enlighten you on these things. Something's karmic about that. So you could have been gossiping about somebody's shitty marriage or relationship external from yours, but somehow or a business deal from yours. And it's happening to you, but th that's your way, like for whatever it is, that's your way of not having to deal with, okay, now I see. That's your way of not having to deal with, with, with I get an Aries. That's your way of not have, of not having to deal with an Aries energy, whether they're a man or a woman, but yet you're dating. You're also dating those energies. You're dating an Aries. You're married to an Aries and you're dating an Aries, female, male energy here. You never thought that you'd end up doing that. Someone's going to have a being bi or gay. So it could be an Aries female if you're a Cancerian woman. You're dating an Aries female. If you're a Cancerian woman, you're married to an Aries man, and you're finding out they have another kid. Or I get more than one, I get more than one son. Somebody has more than one son that you're dating or that you're tied to, and you're. it's all about gossip. It's all gossip coming to the cervix external. But yeah, Sag, there's a Sagittarius energy. Oh, I see what's going on. There's a Sagittarius energy. You have been housing... They're okay. I see this could be you can have a Sagittarius sibling or friend. You have been taking care of their children with the three of cups energy here. Cups represent kids, could be three boys, but yeah, all of those boys are, are, are your are your brothers or your sister's kids. And maybe you're telling, maybe I guess I'm on a Capricorn. You you introduced a Capricorn energies energy, you introduced Capricorn, you introduced a Capricorn to boys that you said were your kids, but they're, but they are Sagittarius energies, kids, or they are Aries kids. And none of them, none of them are your kids, whatever the situation is here. So there were kids that were introduced to you that you thought were like, people thought were yours, some crazy shit like that, but they're not yours. Or it's your partner or kids were introduced to you that, that kids were introduced to you as nieces, nephews, but then, but they're your partner's kids, something crazy like that. And that's what's coming to the surface with the three of cups energy being here. Wow. There's a, I don't know how to hide. Like you don't know how to hide from family. All this is like family secrets to me. The deception with a parent, like a mom, like maybe you feel like a mom has been deceptive. 
This could be if a mom has been deceptive. This is an element here where your your siblings are your cousins. Like they're they're not your siblings. Some type of crazy shit like that. Like you're, maybe your mom. Like you're finding out that you you're finding out that there's there's cousins. Like you've been introduced to people as your cousins, but they're actually siblings. Some type of craziness like that. Why you don't understand why your family has to do those things. You don't understand why family members have to do those things or why they're being or why your brother or there's in-laws, why in-laws are doing shady things to, to other in-laws and sisters and, and nephews. Why why there has to be family lies? What's the point of family lying? People, you know what this feels like? People are really trying to safeguard what they work for. And they someone's gonna have a color. So maybe there's dark, dark and light. This could be carting off light skinned children. You know, dark skinned children. Maybe, maybe, maybe you, maybe for some reason, like you're trying to tell people that, oh, this is not my kid. He's darker. This is, this is my husband's kid. This is, he's not my child. She's not my kid. She's darker. He's lighter. She's darker. Whatever it is, carting off light skinned children to people with the three of cups. You don't understand why family is doing that, why friends are doing that, or it's external, and there's lies, like there's secretive kids, secretive relationships are surrounding you or surrounding somebody. Could be the Capricorn or you. But I get also the Pisces. Like somebody, there's a Pisces energy that they're sharing these kind of things have also happened to a Piscean energy. But I get that's why they're that way. So if you're dealing with a very gossipy Pisces female, Male, whatever, they they are that way because all, shittiness has happened to them in the past. They have also been cheated on. They have also some uh, carding off again. They they have also been they have also experienced being carted off either when they were little, younger, whatever. They have they have been they have experienced being carted off either in a good way or in a bad way with the three of cups by their own parents. You have been doing that by your own parents not being light enough. I guess something about being Asian. So maybe you're like a darker Asian and maybe your parents are lighter or as a cousin. This could be going on in an Asian family with the three of cups. Some type of family, Hispanic, black family, Asian family, all ethnicities. Why is this Why is this happening with the three of cups energy here? Or you're gossiping about families and lies and, 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 and there's judgment with this three of cups energy because you're gossiping a lot or because somebody's talking and revealing things but the Capricorn is revealing things. Well... Damn. What's helping the situation is the page of swords. Somebody's kid is helping. Somebody's kid is, it could be a Gemini child. Somebody's kid is helping the situation. Some air sign kid is helping this situation. But yet, who's your daddy? Like you're interacting with a, with this kid and you're like, who's your dad? They talking about an Aries. An Aries, an Aries has fathered this, uh, this child. There's an Aries that has followed, uh, that has fathered a, a, this air, air sign child. Who's the mom? Like you want to know who the mom is, you know. So if you're married to an Aries energy, if you're if you're a female and you're married to an Aries dude, they have a kid. This kid is not yours. Page of Swords. This kid is not your kid. They're either too light, they're too dark to be somebody's kid. Someone's going here with, with having a child with a woman that is white. So either you could be a white woman, you know, maybe you're a white woman and maybe your child. This energy, this child could be a mixed child. I get that's the Libra's child. This child is a Libra's child with the Page of Swords. They're very light. If it's a Gemini kid, it's a Libra's child. That's a Libra's child with the Three of Cups. But there's a why is she so dark? Like you're trying to understand why someone is so dark. Like this could be in a family. Like you're gossiping about why somebody's kid is so dark, why, why they're so light, why they're mixed. Someone's going to have a jealousy with this child. With your kid, this energy could be your kid. But it's not, it's not your kid with this energy. So either you had a kid with a Gemini, I guess I'm a black man. If you're a white woman, you had a kid, people are trying, oh, I, now I understand. If you're a white woman, you had a kid with a black dude and the child is like, maybe the child was born like dark, more on the darker side, that they're, they're not as light, they're not as light as you thought they were gonna turn out. Or there's a, if there's a situation here where if you're a dude, you slept, I guess I'm a Libra female. You you may have slept with your black guy, or whatever. You slept with a Libra female, and this is her child. But if this is a Libra female that has shown up like a page of swords, they're they're very somebody's very young in their head. Like they somebody's going something's going on with their education level with a Libra. Their education level needs to be bumped up, and that's why they're showing up as a page of swords if it's not a kid. You may be gossiping about these things. You're you're talking about a Libra. This energy needs to go back to school. They're saying really crude things about a Libra female. 
if this page of swords is Libra female or if it's not a kid, or you're gossiping about the darkness and lightness of this child. Either it's not your kid or it's your kid. Did you see with a black man? <laughs> Did you see with an Indian man? Like, what's the deal? Or, or if you're a dude, like your family is gossip gossiping about the darkness and lightness of your kid. Someone going on with bleaching a child. Oh my God. Someone going on here with, with giving a child bleaching cream. Like what type of shit is this? Giving a child bleaching cream? You could get locked up for that shit. What someone someone going on here with African countries and and in and, and Jamaica with cake soap and those kind of things? Like they're bleaching somebody, somebody's trying to bleach your child's skin. Or you you have been doing this? Bleaching cream. But I think it's something about the sad, the Sagittarius energy is trying to do this. They, they, they want to do this, or they're, they, they're, they're intuitively, they're thinking, they don't, there's an energy that they don't want to have to do that. They know that if they have a kid, the kid is going to be darker. And they don't want their kid to go through some type of judgment in school. It could be a Sagittarius energy's child, or people are talking about that. Oh, I see what's going on. That's why a child lives far away because they're dark. A child lives far away somewhere because they're dark. I guess I'm out of Aries. There's an Aries child that lives far away because they're darker. They weren't accepted into a family. But I guess something about female. So it could be a female child was not accepted and there were male children that were accepted into a child into a family environment. This could be something that's happening to you. Maybe you're got maybe you're talking, you're gossiping with your family about these things, or your ace of cups, you're telling your you're telling your your new man, your new woman what your childhood was like and what your parents did to you when you were younger. Why do they your partner wants to know why your parents treated you that way? Why they carted you off? Why they did this to somebody? Why why are they doing this to your children? They, get, they don't like me. When I said your children, that they, they, they don't like me. So either somebody doesn't like a Gemini child, there's a Libra, or there's a Libra energy. There's a Libra female that they're nosy, but they're also there's a Libra energy that's also very insecure about their children being dark and light, or they're insecure about the way they look, period, with the Page of Swords and the Three of Cups energy being here. You don't understand why darkness and lightness of children and, and family dynamics. You don't understand why those things why those things matter. Why is she talking about her kids like that? Like if it's a Libra, you don't you're trying to understand why a Libra energy is talking about their kids, like the darkness and lightness of their kids, or why their children are are talking about darkness and lightness, period. You don't understand that. So if it's not anything to do with family shit. And it's a job like you could be gossiping about uh, you could be gossiping about this energy could be a younger person in your job but if you're gossiping about a young a younger air sign person in your job you're talking about their work ethic could be your work ethic maybe something's going on with your work ethic and and needing needing experience in a job but there's like i don't know how to do these things so you could be in a workplace and you don't know how to do something maybe there's a need you need help in a workplace you're afraid to ask for help in the workplace for some reason. Pisces will help. There's a Pisces energy that will help you. I get another Cancer. Another Cancerian energy will help you. Aries also. These energies will help you in the workplace. Why are you afraid to ask for help? Page of Swords. Page of Swords. What's negative is the tower sign of Scorpio. You want if it's a Scorpio energy, you want them to be quiet. They're talking too much. Something that a Scorpio energy is saying or revealing is, is, is family secrets. It's, there's family secrets that are coming out here, and, and it's, it's, it's embarrassing with, for some reason with the tower energy. How does she know that? Like, if it's a Scorpio female, how does a Scorpio female know these things? This energy could be a coworker, you know, that I get that they that would that was listening to everything. There's a Scorpio coworker that was listening to everything that you were saying to your partner. Right? Your wife, if you're a guy, there's a Scorpio female that was listening to everything that you were saying to your partner in the house. Cups, energy, all these cups with the three of cups energy being here. They were listening behind a door. They may have been listening in the bathroom behind a door. But yet, that's why she's saying that. Like, there's a Scorpio energy that's saying something. Like, she's saying something because because of something that speak because of something that that you said to someone like on the phone or you said you said about this gemini kid or about your own kid or that you said about your own sibling you could have said something crazy about your own sibling about their education level about them going back to school someone didn't finish college it's a libra a libra didn't finish college and you're talking about these things. you're you're talking about these things a scorpio energy is reprimanding you for doing that they're reprimanding you for doing it. Why would you say that about your siblings' kids? Why would you, why would you say that, or about your partner's kids, or about being carted off? Why would you say that? You this tower energy could be you. You could have Scorpio in your chart. You know, I didn't mean to. You didn't mean to do this. You didn't mean to reveal something about somebody's child. Someone with jealousy in children. 
So it could be your partner. Maybe your partner has children that they're light and, and, and that they're light skinned kids. And maybe there's, or they're mixed kids or something like that. And maybe like you're either you're trying to pretend that they're that that they're there that they're yours, or your partner's trying to pretend that they're that 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 oh, oh my god, or your partner is trying to pretend that that there's children that's theirs. Somebody, you know this this is weird. Somebody wants a child. Okay, this this is interesting. You, if you are a sibling, you want your sibling's child. You want your sibling's child. It could be light, like I said, lightness and dark. This could be an element here where your sibling had lighter, like your children, your children are darker than your sibling's children, and you want them. I know it's weird to say, and you want those kids. Vice versa. Maybe your sibling wants, maybe your kids are lighter and your sibling wants your kids. But again, no, you your sibling doesn't want your kids. You want your sibling's kids. It could be an air sign sibling that has light skinned kids. But I guess it's because she's with a white man. So there's a black woman that's with a white man or some dark skinned woman that's with a white man and her kids are lighter. But yet I want that. Oh, wow. This is crazy. So if you're a black woman, if you are a black woman, you are, you are dealing with, okay, this is crazy. If you're a black woman, you are dealing with a situation here where you, you, you may be dating a white, you could be, you could be married or tied or dating a black man. But you, but you, but it's only because maybe there's white men that aren't looking at you. <laughs> you know, maybe there's white, maybe you want them to, you want white men to look at you. You could be talking about these things in the workplace with a Piscean energy. Maybe you wanted to be with a white man and maybe you were like, maybe you wanted your kid to be lighter. You want, if you're a black woman, you want for some, for somebody here, it's resonating with somebody. You, you are a black woman, you want to be with a white man and you want to mix kids or it's external. Or you, or your sibling wants this. Like you, maybe, maybe it's something that your sibling is saying. Uh, uh, maybe it's something that your sibling is is inter is is exposing to you, and you don't understand. Tower energy is negative because the Scorpio energy is bringing it out. But there's a, all these questions are coming out. with us. how does she hear? How does she know? How does she just that? It's a she. It could be a man. If it's a Scorpio man, they don't care about these conversations. If it's a Scorpio man, they're external. They don't give a shit about these kind of the, the pettiness. They don't care about these kind of conversations. The Scorpio energy, they're either doing it, doing, they're either bringing out shit intentionally or unintentionally. You can't really stop this energy from doing that. It could be a matriarch or a cousin with Scorpio in their chart. Somebody got a Scorpio moon. There's a Capricorn energy that has a Scorpio moon and they're bringing stuff out. Then there's a matriarch Scorpio energy that's bringing stuff out about a lightness and darkness of children want a lighter kids your friends like your your sibling your if you're a dark skinned person and your sibling is also dark your, your sibling is married to someone that's light or white and they have light skinned kids and you're like I want that vice versa vice versa or if it's a job maybe someone's going to, you, you were talking about somebody's work ethic or or their brain activity in a damn job or 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 you were talking about them in a family and the scorpio energy is bringing them out there's an element here where Scorpio favors a Libra because they're lighter or because they got pretty kids, whatever it is. A Scorpio favors a Libra, like over a Pisces. A Scorpio favors a Libra over a Pisces, and that's what you're talking about, and that's what's coming out. Damn. Whew. You're in your, what's it called again? I forgot. The advice is coming from the five of coins. Five of coins. You may be looking for a new job. You can't take the favoritism. <laughs> like there's favoritism that's happening. This could be going on in the job, lightness and darkness of a person in a damn job. This could be the energy, combative energy that you're dealing with in a, in a job, lightness and darkness of a person, expertise. You don't understand why this energy is being favored in a damn job. It was a younger air sign. Like I, I did get Libra, some younger air sign that you're dealing with in a job. You, you don't understand why they're being favored with the five of coins. You're looking for new work because you can't deal with the favorite. It could be earth sign energies that are being, I got a Virgo. It could be a Virgo energy that's being favored because either they know what they're doing or they don't, they, they think that they know what they're doing, but intuitively you, they don't know what they're doing. Like you may feel like you could do a better job than someone in a workplace. That's what's coming out, tower energy. But when I said that's what's coming out, you didn't mean for something to come out the way it did. It could be social media. Like I get typing, you typed something. You you type, you could have sent a text to somebody. I get the wrong. You sent a text to the wrong person. You sent a text a text to the wrong person. Oh, I see what's going on here. There's a Virgo energy that you set up to go. I get a Capricorn. There's a Virgo energy that you set up to go follow a Capricorn. 
And a Capricorn energy text something to a Virgo, but it was an accident with the three of cups or, or you did that or, or, or you, but they said something about show, somebody. Okay. Now I see. So that's why I said somebody intuitively knows this energy as if it's an earth sign energy, they intuitively know that, that again, Sag, they intuitively know that a Sag has other kids intuitively. And that's what's coming out with the tower energy being here. Something scary though, like something scary about this energy is because it's okay. Now I see why it's scary. Somebody's revealing things could be this energy here. Like I said, Capricorn or moon in their chart, Scorpio in their chart or it's a damn Scorpio period. Somebody's revealing things, but they're not saying anything directly to, I get a Sag. They're not, it could be you. You're, you're not, it could be, you're making the Sagittarius energy scared <laughs> because you know things because of a Pisces or it's external and someone is revealing things that are going on in a workplace or in a family dynamic or about secretive kids. You feel like somebody, this energy, they're revealing things, but they're not saying anything, anything directly to somebody, but it's scaring people. I like get family it's it's scaring family members, but somebody's very, very quiet. The energy that the, the, the energy is revealing things is very quiet. You could be the one that's revealing things and you're being quiet about revealing shit or it's this energy. They're revealing things and, and they're being quiet and this scary energy with that. They're scared. People are scared now. But yes, Sag is a, a Sagittarius energy is scared. They're scared. Wow. They're becoming scared of you. They may, they may be, be they may be becoming scared of you because you're revealing things about them. Or is this energy is doing that in a workplace or a family dynamic? Oh, most recent issue has the four of coins. But I get given them what I have left. You're trying to, this could be like you want to work with somebody. You're, you're, I get some, you, some of them I'll keep, okay, now I see what's going on. You may have bribed in our sign energy. You may have given them some type of money. It could be $4,000, $400. You're, you're trying to get, you have been given in our sign energy all that you have left to keep them quiet. Oh, now I see what's going on here. That's why I said somebody's revealing things and then being really quiet. This could be an element here where you're, you're trying to befriend an earth sign. You're trying to befriend earth sign energies. But, or a Sag, or a Sag is trying to be friend and earth sign energy so that they would stop doing something or giving, or you're, you're trying to tell a, a Sag or you're trying to give earth sign energy gifts and things so that they would stop. They're not going to stop doing something. You think that somebody's doing something on a spike, five of coins. That's why it's a five. That's why this person looks crazy on this card. <laughs> so I have financial drain. You're also trying to protect your placement in a job. So you're bribing people to go follow someone or you're trying to get people, someone's going with made up jobs. Like you're trying to find like a fake job for someone to work at so they will stop doing something, but it's not going to work. Somebody's going to continue doing something as an earth sign energy. They're going to continue doing something. So if it's money, maybe you're going to, the four coins, five of coins, maybe you're going to continue doing your work, whether your mom likes what you're saying about your sibling or not. Maybe you work at home. Maybe you work at home and your family is, is always in your business all the time. You may you may work at home, but maybe people see, maybe you're not taking care of your kids for some reason. Maybe your kids are running amok and, and you're sitting and chilling. Maybe that's what's going on with the three of cuts. Or it's external and it's a, a Sagittarius energy that has a Gemini kid. And they need a, a Capricorn. They need a Capricorn energy's help. And you're trying to figure out ways to make secretive phone calls to get someone to go see a Gemini child. Or it's a Gemini child is being favored because they're lighter. There's a Sagittarius energy that's jealous of that. Like they're they're jealous of the fact their wife, like they're jealous of the fact that their wife is going to spend time with a light-skinned child or a white child. You don't understand. And these are things that they've been talking about, or you or, or you set up you and a Sag or an Aries, whatever, you you set up that to happen to someone, but somebody's not going to their job or somebody's not going to spend time with their kids as they're supposed to, whatever that means. Whatever that means. Oh my God! What's answer? What the answers are coming from the six of wands? But I get I don't, I, you're like I'll just do it myself. You're like I'll just do it myself. Whatever it is. So it could be it could be like you're you're trying to like you're trying to get deliveries. Like maybe you're trying to do deliveries, but you need the money to get, to get deliveries done for some. It could be hair and makeup kind of stuff. Whatever kind of job you do. This energy, if it's a page of swords, they're not helpful. So it could be a kid or a younger person. It could be a sibling. They're not very helpful. That's what you're gossiping about. They're, they're not helpful with deliveries or I get packing. They're not helpful with packing. It could be a kid that's not help, helpful with packing, but it's because they're a privileged child. Like this is a very privileged child, a privileged younger person that a Scorpio energy favors and you can't stand that. 
by also get losing money to a Scorpio energy. Like you're, you're starting to lose money to a Scorpio. But yeah, a Gemini. A Gemini energy is starting to lose money to a Scorpio. That's why the tower is there. Wow. A Gemini energy is starting to lose money to a Scorpio. The four of coins could be, maybe you're trying to hold on to a Gemini energy. Page of swords could be, like a, like I said, Gemini. It's either a Gemini child or a Gemini younger person. But when I say a Gemini younger person, they're not very smart. Page of swords. They're not very smart. Somebody, somebody is copying and pasting things. So it could be this energy in your workplace. They're copying and pasting things. Maybe you're trying to get them to lose it. You're, maybe you're trying to get them fired. You're trying to get them out of a job. Or they're trying to get you out of a job. There's a Scorpio energy that's not helping the situation. They could be a boss. They could be the boss. And maybe you're trying to go to your boss for more hours. You may be trying to go to your, that's what you're talking about online or with friends and family. You're trying to get your boss to give you more hours, but this person is like, like they're, they're, they're hogging the hours. They're hogging the hours, five of coins, four of coins. You're using intuition that you need to, to go and do new work or you, this, uh, like I said, not being helpful with packing and delivering things. You're going to have to do it yourself. Somebody's not helping you in the workplace. This energy's not helping you, or or someone's going out there with their expertise, or their sibling that they need to go back to school. Someone's like, you're calling your sibling names. Your mom is like, don't say that. You intuitively, you know, your sibling is is being favored over you because they're prettier, they they got better looking kids, and like, you know that, or you heard somebody say that. Dark and light, children. Or it's your partner's kids. Like maybe this is something external, and you and you're again you're on the phone. You you hear you hear your partner talking to their other woman on the phone, and and they have lighter kids, and there's or they're, or they're gone for long period of t periods of time because you know that your Aries your, your Aries partner or whoever is, is spending time with their kids, or is spending time with their lighter children, lighter darker kids, whatever. You may have light you may have dark kids with someone, but they also have kids with their lighter children. And you're going to spend time with their lighter children, or dark, whatever it is, and you got dark kids or you got light kids, and they're spending, or they could be spending more time with your children that you have with them. It's an Aries man, or it's a business. This could be something going on in a business here, but you you hired, you may have hired this person, or you someone's going on with opportunists. This energy is an opportunist, and maybe things come easy to them, but you feel like they don't deserve something or their spot, their place. Because if something's going on with a Capricorn energy, like you feel like they, they deserve this energy space, this spot, their spot. Gemini, workplace, family, secrets, colorism in a family. Scorpio energy is bringing it out. Or it's a Capricorn with Scorpio in their chart. Family secret stuff. Damn. The environment has the strength card, sign of Leo. This energy is leaving. It's a, if it's a Leo, they're leaving or they have left already or they passed or they left. They're leaving. Maybe your strength is leaving with this situation. You somebody is very powerful. I get some. There's a Capricorn energy that's very powerful. Scorpio energy very powerful. They're defeating this person. If it's younger air sign or or you, maybe this tower. Like I said, this tower energy could be you, and you're defeating this person. Or uh, either they can be defeated. Or they can't be. Whatever that means. It's because of mystical powers or spells with the strength. You could be doing that. But I get you're doing that to protect a Gemini. You're trying to protect your niece, your nephew, a friend, a coworker from somebody triumphing over. So it could be a Leo. Maybe this, maybe this is like I said, external on this. I get can't deal. There's a Leo energy that can't deal with the workplace dynamic anymore. There's a Virgo energy that's not doing a good job. Like they're fucking up. They're fucking up. They're not doing a good job. This energy was hired or they've already been been somewhere, but they they're only somewhere because they look good in a job, in a workplace, in a family. Or they're being favored in a family, or they're being favored because they have light kids. But there's a grandma, why? Like, you're like, grandma, why do you, why? Your grandma could be doing this to you. Grandma, why? Why are you, why are you doing this to my kids? Grandma, why are you favoring? You could have been raised, you, you and your sibling could have been raised by your grandma. I always kind of see Scorpio Tower energy as a matriarch, somebody that's old. Grandma, why are you? Your grandma could be the one that's that's leaving. She or she's leaving you. I, I up to fight. So, there's a parent that's leaving a house for siblings to just go at each other because of because of what a, a parents did to them when they were younger, or what somebody's doing to you in a job. Somebody's leaving a job. That it, it could be a Leo coworker is leaving 
for people to just leave them up to the wolves, just to fight, what fight for, for placement, fight and carry on with each other. Tower energy. That's why it's in the negative spectrum. How do we out this fire? It could be an actual fire. How do we out the fire? Tower energy. How do we out this fire? Metaphoric fire or actual one? They're leaving. I'm just going to do it myself. They're leaving. So because they're leaving, because Leo is leaving, you're like, I'm, I'm going to have to pick up responsibility. It could be leaving a business deal. Because they don't like what's going on. They There's a Leo that doesn't like what's happening to somebody. Lies that are happening to someone. Deceit around them in a workplace or a person. They don't like it. Or they hung around for a long period of time, but maybe they came back and they left again. Came back and they left again. It's a Leo. Family environment. Somebody, so you think that somebody left a family or a workplace be, because of like whatever, a new job or they bought a house or whatever it is, but that's not the reason. They don't, they don't like what's going on with colorism in a job and they know that. Family environment, colorism in a family. But again, that's why they don't talk to you. That's why a Leo doesn't talk to you. Vice versa. That's why you don't talk to a Leo. Interesting. So whatever it is, could be business, could be secrecy and colorism and business and secretive kids that people aren't telling people that they got <laughs> some stupid shit like that. All right, let's see the outcome cancer. What's underneath is the Ten of Pentacles. You're making a lot of money. You're deciding to stay in a workplace that's not right. Or you see shadiness going on and favoritism in the workplace. That's stupid. The outcome actually is the Ten of Cups. Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Cups energy here for the outcome. You're going to check it out. You're going you're gonna to keep pushing. But I get whether your mom likes it or not. Whether your mom likes it or not. So it could be work that you do inside of a home. Maybe this could be something that you do inside of a family. It could be some type of family stuff that you do and and or some type of family work. It could be a family business that this is happening in. Favoritism in a family business and colorism in a family. You like you're gonna continue doing what you need to do, but you, when you're trying to keep family together, but either you're doing it in the wrong way, or you are you doing it in the wrong or right way, keeping family together. But there's a, I don't want him here. And I'm looking at the Leo in it. This could be a man or a woman. If it's a female, they left, they stormed out of a workplace environment. If it's a male, you you don't want that energy around for some reason. Somebody's mother did not like this person. Your mom, they didn't like them. So this could be a situation. This could be your sibling. This could be a cousin. And maybe a, this could be family stuff where this energy may have kids. And they're bringing their kids, but their kids are darker. That's why I said this energy is being favored. Somebody's kid is being favored because they're light. You are being favored. Or it's a coworker. Or it's a younger coworker. Or somebody's side woman is like I said, if you, you're a female and your partner has this energy could be a side woman and they're light. Side woman, side dude is lighter or, or better looking or something. And they're being favored. They're being favored. This energy could be a housemate that saw something happen on camera. They saw something happen. But like who came through the door? Like this energy, like who came through some door? Who came through the door? Somebody came through somebody's door. And because somebody came through the door, it's it's causing like um, what do you call it? It's it's causing like craziness to happen because somebody came through some door. Could have been a locked door. That's that's why I said from the beginning, you keyed into some door, and you, and you're you're seeing things that are not yours, secretive accounts for people. But I get that money is not for you. It, it, either it's for this energy, or maybe this could be an element here. Okay, okay, wills and stuff like that. This energy, like maybe they have wills. Like this could be your mom or dad or something. Somebody's got wills being kept for siblings and stuff. But there's money, like maybe somebody's breaking down a will or something, and and it could be this energy. Either it's this energy or this energy. It could be two parents. The strength card it could be a Leo and a Scorpio parent that somebody had, or two Leo parents, or one Leo parent. That's why they left, they left, they passed. But they, this energy, like they left money, and people are family members are going crazy over it. They're going crazy over it. But there's money that's being left for a secretive kid that nobody knew about, a secret sibling, or somebody's light skinned kid, hmm. or your light skinned sibling, or your sibling that's lighter than you, or you are that lighter sibling. But when I picked up this card, I get, I'm better. This energy is like, I'm better. I'm better, workplace. 
picking over in the workplace, getting picked over by this energy you don't understand. They didn't go back to school. They don't even they don't even have a bachelor's degree and they're getting hired over you. Looks. Your man's other woman. Some your man's other children. Somebody's other kid or your other children, or maybe you're doing this with favoritism with your kids and somebody else's kids that you're talking to. All right. So let me know how it resonates. Cancer, let me know. Be blessed. Take care. Bye.